I really wanted that to work. If we do it again, because Ella's shooting and that, now I look like a Day three of Wasteland the Panda, we're back on uh, the set that we've spent the most time on. Uh, we're here in the gorge. Uh, it's a beautiful little set. Uh, it's a bit toasty today, but um, I'm gonna be brave because there's a nice little breeze going on. The fork, I because these panda hands, and it was like a tiny man sized fork, okay? So there's me trying to desperately pick it up with ease, like, I, like a person who can handle a fork. Um, but uh, instead I just uh, found myself trying to scoop it out like a like some kind of imbecile who can't use their hand properly um, and uh, just uh, using it like a regular person was difficult but I managed I got there in the end mostly because I had people handling it to me on camera it's day seven Sunday um, day six. Well, day six. Day six is shooting, but day seven of the production. Yesterday was all fight at the scene, choreography. Um, today we're in an abandoned uh, shop. All goes well so far. Although this crack house isn't the best place I've ever been. But hey, that's show business. In position to head home. This guy. It's just a big heat box. But it's a good take. It's good you haven't fainted though, have you? I haven't fainted, nor would the crew at Wasteland of Panda let me faint. Um, because everyone's great and they're always telling me to make sure I'm always giving them reports. They're always bringing me water um, when we're filming it to make sure they, they look good. Always bringing, me, always bringing me lols. Yeah. Uh, maybe a strawberry cream. Right? Strawberry cream? You want a strawberry cream? Yeah, that'd be great. Um, oh, thanks, man. So we're in the scrapyard, um, which is our third key location. Yesterday we were at the shop and of course the Flinders Rangers. Um, we'll be here for three days. Uh, today it's mostly establishing shots. Right now it's pretty cool. So I'm pretty cool. That attitude could change during the day. So <laughs> we'll wait and see. It's day eight at the scrapyard. Um, what we're doing today is the scene where I meet a collection of bandits um, as um, Isaac the Panda, who I was playing yesterday and the day before that. Um, I have broken a neck and I have also um, had to hit Nathan, uh, who was the uh, stunt guy, repeatedly with a cigar tin. Um, and I started feeling really bad about that because sometimes I'd hit him with the corner of the tin. I've never hit someone in the head with a cigar tin before, so that was new to me. And the panda thing, the whole panda head, gives me a different sense of, I don't know, uh, strength and adrenaline. There's adrenaline pumping in that scene. I want to hit someone. So when I get machetes tomorrow, it'll get very interesting. This is my last day on uh, Oyster and the Panda. It's been a great shoot. Uh, I've been to Flinders Rangers, been to some, uh, some crack house. Well, it's not, I shouldn't call it a crack house, but some kind of. We did smoke crack there though. <laughs> <laughs> some temporary accommodation for crackheads um, uh, house. Um, domicile, uh, which was fun. And uh, now here in the scrapyard where things will come to an end. Um, Hopefully, if you've seen this message, I haven't hurt anyone or really, really badly with machetes. It's going to be completely safely done. We've got the people from Feet here today who are fantastic. They're going to make sure everything goes wonderfully and people are confident in me wielding machetes, so that's good too. Because if I heard so any nervous looks from anyone, then that would make me nervous. But I'm confident. My head, my panda head is confident. It's going to be a good day. Okay, so everything's being torn down. We've like been racing uh, to get things done in time. We did. We didn't have the luxury of kind of getting extra shots, but we got what we needed. I think I broke Marcus the record who plays Archaeus. I'm, th I'm saying two and a half hours. People are saying he did two hours, so two and a half hours in the head. I'm feeling pretty proud of myself. And then, of course, a couple more hours in the afternoon. I'm cooked. My head's cooked. And yet, for some reason, I'm gonna miss being in this little hot thing because it's exciting and uh, it's, a, it's a great crew to be around and uh, it's been an awesome day. It's day 20 and we're back on set. <laughs> it's me from the panda suit. 
<laughs> just thought I'd try my hand at every part of production. Not, you can't tell, but I'm also holding that camera that you're watching me through right now. I was Isaac yesterday. I was um, crowd member number two. Now I'm prisoner number three. Um, today I'm going for a kind of um, sad, lonely kind of possum kind of, of a character. Yeah. Uh, I think I, kind of like Harrison Ford in The Fugitive, I was put here for crimes I didn't commit, I was framed. By a one-armed man? By a one-armed man, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you do that? <laughs> <laughs> 